Right, so I've just had, I think I slept for about 15 hours anyway. There's actually not much to do here at the moment. The reason is we're mainly in Bangkok just as like a stopover to get over the jet lag because we thought it would be really bad, which it sort of was. But we're here for four days, so I think we're gonna rest and go to the gym and stuff today. And uh, obviously I'm going to the shop as well, get some food. And then tomorrow and the next day, we're gonna go to a few places. We're gonna go to like this park place with a few temples. So we found, I, th I think I'm gonna have to do this in retrospect because my other vlog parts were filmed on my phone. We found a really cool little cafe called Li uh, Like a Local. It's called Like a Local and then on the front it says a giant word that says coffee in neon letters. It's also very, very difficult to be a vegan in, uh, in Bangkok. Um, so I've, I'm just gonna make an exception. I'm just gonna go with some loose vegan, more vegetarian, like, you know, if there's a croissant or something, or, you know, it's just gonna be more realistic. Because it's, if it's between, you know, staying completely vegan and keeping my calories up so I actually, you know, stay healthy and maintain my body weight, I'm gonna choose the, uh, the vegetarian route just because I'd rather, you know, be healthy and have energy. All things to the shop. is what is the uh, the view from this side of it. Go over here. And there's like a main road thing. Yeah, pretty cool view I guess. They've even got a little life ring. 
life jacket thing for in case I decide I can't swim for whatever reason. Okay, I'm gonna try and get on the roof and see what the views are like from there.